And the third thing I would say to the people why they're rarely successful with side hustles is because they see it as a side hustle. They see it as something that I just do in the evening or something I just do for a couple of hours at the weekend. And what they're thinking is that I'm doing this side hustle because I want to make maybe an extra thousand dollars this month or maybe two thousand dollars or maybe only a hundred dollars a week or whatever. But because they see such a small figure, I want you to think about this for a moment. If you are just building a side hustle that you hope is only going to bring in $100 or maybe $1,000 a month. Do you really think that that number, because of its size, is going to motivate you, is going to inspire you, is going to get you to get outside your comfort zone and take action every single day? Now, if you maybe increased the figure that you were looking to get from your side hustle, from maybe $1,000 up to maybe ten or fifteen or $20,000 a month, if your eyes were up there, I'm sure you could see that you would be far more committed, that you would actually show up regularly, that you'd be constantly writing blog posts and constantly making videos and constantly, you know, being online to build that business because you're looking at a huge amount of money that you are hoping to achieve from that side hustle rather than the 100 or thousand dollars. I'm sure you can see, you know, if you think at a higher figure, it's going to make you more committed. It's going to make you want to do the work because your eyes are up here. Instead of looking at a small amount that if it doesn't show up, well, it doesn't show up. If it won't make the hundred thousand or the hundred dollars or the thousand dollars, well, it's no big deal. It's going to be no change in my life. You know, why would anyone get outside the comfort zone for an extra hundred dollars? You know, why would someone sit down right now in front of a, a video like this or a camera like this and even if they've never recorded videos, actually force themselves to make videos for TikTok or YouTube or whatever if it's only for the sake of an extra hundred dollars? Whereas if their mindset was on earning fifteen, twenty, thirty thousand dollars a month, I'm sure you can see that that thought would commit you to force yourself outside your comfort zone because that's where you're going to. So in my mind, those are the three, sorry, the three reasons why people aren't successful with side hustles.